we're here at the Durham Centre tonight. Uh, it's Sports' 10th anniversary this year, so we're really excited to be here in the North East. We've got more than 40 of our members coming down this evening to celebrate that with us and just to share in a really great evening's worth of activity. They'll be hearing from us about our progress over those 10 years, listening to the, what the future might hold for us at Sported, but also sharing their experiences and the challenges that they face and how the, our partnership with TSB may be able to help them in future. Groups will be able to share lots of things with each other. They'll be able to network with each other, which they know is really valuable for them. They'll also be able to learn a lot more about social media, so we've got some skills that they'll be able to pick up uh, here. They'll also have some insight from children in need in the region, so how they might better apply for some additional funding. And they'll just be able to understand a lot more about the TSB partnership and the potential value that could create for them. Really pleased to be here this evening to celebrate 10 years of Sported. I think it's been really key in our journey in the North East to developing GFS into a really fresh and modern organisation, meeting the needs of girls and young women. So I'm delighted to meet together um, and to meet new partners and potentially engage with different sports and, and, and like-minded people from those organisations. It's great to see the relationship between um, TSB and, and Sported that can only add value to, the, to their offer, to create new opportunities locally for, for members, for clubs, for young people. These events tonight are incredibly important to network, um, to, to build relationships up, to identify new partners that can add value to our work and hopefully in return we can support their work. We've made new links with organisations from uh, Middlesbrough, we've got other links from Newcastle, so I'm hoping to do more partnership events, hoping to do some cricket tournaments and football tournaments between cross boundaries. Yeah, it's exciting time ahead for Young Asian Voices in Sunderland, so I'm hoping this, this, is, this has brought us a great chance to mix with everyone.